Hello guys, welcome back to the C1 Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily C1 Engineering videos. Today our lecture is about the difference between the stirrups, ties and the spiral. These three type of the reinforcement are called as the transverse reinforcement. Transverse reinforcement. And these reinforcement are used in different structure members that's why they have different names and in this video I will explain their differences so these are known as the transverse reinforcement and they are used their function and their purpose is the same and they are used for the lateral forces lateral forces mean for the shear forces are the earthquake forces they are used their design for the earthquake resistant forces are the wind forces so their main purpose is the lateral forces resistance while they have the same purpose all these three ties spiral and the stirrups have the same function of the lateral forces resistance so now to discuss the differences the stirrups first of all i will explain the stirrups the stirrups is the transverse reinforcement but in beams right if i consider this is the beam right if i consider this is the beam so in beam we place the lateral reinforcement and this lateral reinforcement is called as the stirrups for example this is the beam and these are the reinforcement sidewise reinforcement usually in the field the labors call this type of the reinforcement is the rings but this is not the technical terms used in civil engineering we call it the stirrups in the civil engineering this terms is known as the stirrups in case of the beams while in case of the columns we have different name in case of the rectangular or the square column right in case of the square or rectangular column we call it ties like this is the square or rectangular column so in this case they have different name and this reinforcement now called as the ties these rings which the labor uh, call these type of rings this call this is now called as the ties in civil engineering however the spiral are also used in the column this is the column also used in the columns but in the case of the circular column like this is a circular column so in this column we place the uh, transverse reinforcement throughout the uh, depth throughout the depth of the column or through the height of the column but this reinforcement is now known as the spiral reinforcement or the spiral so this was the main difference between these three types of the reinforcement however their function and purpose is the same that it bond or ties the main reinforcement and it resists the shear forces but they have different technical terms as the ties as the stirrups and the spiral so it should be kept in mind that when you are going to design a member or when you read a drawing in the field you should know the difference between these three types of the uh, reinforcement. So this was the today topic and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.